Mr. Miyagi style. I'm going to do a really quick sample here. I have four cameras set up. Uh, I'm going to start off with this one here. I'm going to point at the lens. This is going to be the Ace Pro. I'm going to point at this one. This is going to be the Gold 3S. I'm going to point at this one. This is going to be the X4. And then we're going to point to the last one, which is going to be the DJI Action 5 Pro. I'm just going to do this for, I'm not going to do the A4 because I've done the A4 before already. Um, we're going to look at the close focusing. So for people who are doing vlogging, that kind of stuff, um, a typical range for me, for me anyways, it may be different for somebody else. I don't, I don't micro vlog, vlog. I don't vlog up close. Uh, my is about a hand extension, which is anywhere from about 20 to 24 inches for me. And that's comfortable uh, with all the cameras that I use. And with the Ace Pro having a, uh, um, a limited um, a minimum focus range, um, it is a limitation of the lens. It's not a flaw. It's just a limitation of that like a lens. Um, they have addressed this limitation in the Ace Pro 2 from what I've heard. Um, I think they've changed the lens a little bit. Uh, so you do get a little bit better f uh, close focusing. So for the vloggers who are fo uh, vlogging a little bit closer, you're going to actually finally going to have a camera that's going to have that uh, that uh, desired focus range. Um, the Gold 3 doesn't have a problem, neither does the X4, I believe. And I know the X, uh, the um, uh, the DJI uh, Action 5 does not. The H, uh, Action 4 does not either. Uh, so right now I'm about 24 inches to all these cameras. And it should be focused for all of them. So this is the desired area for focusing for most cameras. Uh, I vlog about this distance anywhere from 20 to 24 inches. I have long arms, so some people are a little bit closer, some people are further, right? Um, you know, if you're if you're micro vlogging this close, then you're probably not going to want to go with the Ace Pro just because of that limited minimum focus range. Um, the Go 3S would be a good uh, uh, um, a good uh, device. Uh, the Action A4, A5 would be a good device. Even the X4 would be a good device because they don't have that limited range in terms of the minimum focus. So I'm just going to do a quick test. It's going to be a really quick video, guys. Uh, not my normal rant of, you know, 50 minutes. Uh, so hopefully we'll keep this under 10 minutes. <laughs> but uh, anyways, I'm going to do 24 inches. So you should be focused here at 24 inches. Uh, I'm going to go 12 inches here. So I'm not sure if you guys, I'm moving around and because it's kind of wide the way I have my camera set up here. So let's look at the, about 12. This is about 12 inches, 13 inches. I don't think you're going to vlog this much closer, to be honest with you. Uh, tell me how the focus is on these. Uh, I'm going to take a peek at them. They should be all good with the exception of the Ace Pro because of its limitation. And I'm going to go really close. Like this is micro vlog. I don't know. I don't know. If, I don't want to look at my face this close. But I'm about, I would say, seven inches, six inches from the camera. So tell me which one is focused. Which one has the best focus? Sorry. <laughs> and then I'm going to go back about 12 inches. And I'm going to go back to my comfortable 20 to 24 inches right here. Of course, I'm going to go back a little bit further. They should be all focused, not a problem at all. Uh, but yeah, all these are shooting at 4K 30 frames per second. Normal color profile, uh, with the exception of the Ace Pro, I'm shooting at flat, <clears throat> just because I'm trying to keep it in order with the uh, DJI, because the DJI is a little bit flatter in terms of color, so I want to keep that the same. It's just using the log profile on the uh, on the Ace Pro. The X4 will be shooting standard color, and the Go 3S will be shooting standard color. All these are in D warp mode, uh, and stabilizations, the standard stabilization for the uh, Insta360 cameras, and rock steady on the uh, on the uh, DJ action. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think, um, and go from there. Have a good one. Take care. Bye.